I'd like to take this opportunity to wish every woman in the world a happy Women's Day. And not just today, March 8th, but every single day I would like to wish them a happy day of celebrating women. It's often been said women are not an exception to the world, they are the heartbeat of the world. It is important that we recognize and appreciate women for their awesome and indelible achievements in our lives because without women, none of us would be here. For that reason, men need to learn how to respect, honor, and cherish women in their lives, at home, and in the workplace. Every man involved in misogynistic behaviors and mindsets and marginalizing women as far as their pay is concerned need to have a change of heart and mind because that could be their sister, mother, or wife. And not only men, but other women also need to respect other women. As Chimanda Ngozi Adichie, a Nigerian writer, once said, we should all be feminists. What was she saying? We should all stand up for the rights of women. And if anyone wants to debate that fact, then they need to self-examine. Because we should respect women for what they have done. Women are strong and courageous in that they embark on a very challenging nine-month journey, think about it, in many instances, to deliver a child all by themselves. Because the men who should be there were nowhere to be found. Others single-handedly raise kids all by themselves again. And that should have nothing but mad respect. A former U.S. Supreme Court justice once said, women belong in all places where decisions are made. It shouldn't be that women are the exception. I have had the pleasure of being chiseled and groomed into the person I am today by a great woman, my mom, who till today instills common sense, etiquette, and discipline into my life. As my Angelou, a great American poet, once said, I come as one but I stand as 10,000. Women are an embodiment of strength, resilience, and grace. Some of the most nurturing individuals in the world are women. I have had the pleasure of being tutored and trained and coached and mentored in classes with great teachers who are women, who nurtured me, and gave me an opportunity to thrive and shine. Too many to mention. But there's one I will mention, and that is my mentor, Mary, without whom I would not be in my element today. I'm so grateful that she took a chance on me to give me all of her study materials, worth hundreds of dollars at the time in 2005, pure gold, to study for the PMP exam. And that is the direction I went in. But without her being a beacon of light towards where I needed to go, providing the resources, there would be absolutely no hope. And I'm so grateful to her. She had faith and believed in me and encouraged me and held me accountable. When my boss, a man, refused to be part of my PMP exam development, she put all of her resources on the line and continued to encourage me. I since got certified and again, she opened another door to an organization now known as Skillsoft, where she had a connection. And that helped me cut my teeth in training project management to live audiences in big numbers. To Mary, I am extremely grateful. And speaking of this journey that I've embarked on, I would like to give a shout out to every single one of my students who are formidable women, strong women in a lot of instances. My classes have predominantly women learning project management to get to that next level. The majority of the members of my Project Leadership Institute are also women. To each one of you, I celebrate you, I applaud you, and I acknowledge you. Well done 
and continue the amazing work and awesome things you do. Holding down the fort at home, supporting your families, being there for your kids and your parents, even in their old age. I salute you. Well done. In conclusion, every woman in the world is a gem to be celebrated, acknowledged, respected, and accorded every opportunity that she deserves. To all women, happy Women's Day. I celebrate you. I applaud you. I respect you. And I pray for greater heights and success in all your endeavors. As Mahatma Gandhi, an Indian independence activist, once said, be the change you wish to see in the world. Happy Women's Day.